<laughs> when your dad texts you or you're at work and says, Oh, I'm not really sure if I ran this over, but uh, you need a new bee smoker. <laughs> so, what does one do when one gets over a bee smoker? Well, he upgrades. What is this? Bee Co Australia. Nice. Stainless steel design. Nice and easy to use. I've used it once. It's got a welded in uh, baffle plate down the bottom so your bellows work. So, replaceable bellows, just undo the bolt. Nice bellows. Actually, worked out well. I had a flame shooting out of it when I first used it. Anyway, there you go, Beach Hill Australia. About 100 bucks. Hey guys, welcome back to Holistic Harvest. It's early in the morning here uh, at the farm. Just thought I'd bring you up and show you the bees and uh, I've got some new plastic hives. Um, I'll do a little bit of a review on them. I traditionally use wooden hives. I've got four wooden hives and a, what used to be a double split nuke, but um, I'll show you what happened to you anyway. So the two larger colonies there, the two 10 frame boxes, they're the ones we're currently harvesting honey from, not now because we're in the middle of winter. It's um, July here so they're using enough to get warm. A little nuke box in the middle, it was a very 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 hot hive and I split it in the middle of winter which is not advised but they were just crazy and I went into that other nuke box there. So then, hence, we needed two more, two more hives. So now we go from four hives to six hives. You can see all timber boxes. Um, there's bees flying in and out of them. It's cold. 10 degrees or something. There is actually bees in both of those. And, um, with the hopes that they make a new queen and mate with some of these other hives that are really nice. Those two hives have a nice queen in them. That hive has a nice queen in it. And that one, well, it's, it's okay. Recently just changed the stand. They were sitting on this box. I changed it to a couple of besser blocks with a couple of treated timber. They sit on there, that's just not bad. No, oh, look, it comes back a bee. Hey, mate. A bit more active later on today. Be able to change a box over, maybe. I'll have to figure out where I'm going to fit them. Have a bit of a look in there before we split them into the new boxes. All right. So this is how they how they come. I've just ripped this box open. Um, these are from New Plus. Australia in Victoria. We're in Queensland, so they took a little bit to get here, as does everyone's stuff at the moment. And they're a they're a moulded high density plastic. Um, I was recommended them by another beekeeper um, that has like 400 hives. That's what they use. It's a time saver, and what I figure is they'll be a bit better time saving wise. We'll see if the bees like them. That's that's my main concern. So it's a fully moulded, vented lid. It's actually, you know, it's it's actually probably on par, maybe a little bit heavier than a than a, a wooden lid. And then the base, so you can get you can get a a fully vented base um, to the little entrances there, or you can get a non-vented base, we're in Queensland, get the vented base, um, won't be a bit better for the summer, and again, that's nice and solid, you know, like, the walls, they're an inch, inch thick, inch round, inch all round, 25 mil, and then, you get your sides, and, um, they just, if you just chuck the base down on the ground like this, you just get, 
Two sides, moulded handles. You can chuck your nameplate on there. A um, bit different places to screw in latches. And you just get, you get, obviously this is a two frame, a two box kit. It doesn't come with frames. So, they just have these um, little tabs and they just go into those little tabs. It's a bit hard to do one handed. I should buy a tripod. Eh? Just clip together like that. You run a little two and a half mil pilot drill through them and it's also got ones on the side and then you assemble them. And then through the power of internet, we'll show you a finished one. It's one I put together last night. Um, so here it is fully put together. Not a bad little, little box. It's got these little entrance excluders, closers. Um, nice, nice handles. And they just, yeah, they just screw together. You get a stainless steel screw set in the pack. It's just, you know, just a standard, standard box. Other than that, that's the screw pack. Obviously, it's empty. I've used them. And uh, that's it. That's all you do. The idea is. So yeah, guys, there you go. I'm, I'm actually pretty impressed with like how thick they are. They seem insulated. Um, the lids are a full one piece. They won't rot. I've already had some dramas with them rotting since I've had bees. And um, yeah, why did I get them? I got them just to give them a try. See if the bees like them. If the bees don't like them, they'll be back to timber. But I, I, I hope they do because it saves me a lot of time. Don't have to paint them. You assemble them. You have to assemble a timber hive as well, but it's glue and screw. These are just run a pilot, screw them together, they're done. You don't have to paint them. Uh, they do come in different colors, blue and pink. Uh, not usually in stock. But uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see. I mean, they're definitely a time saver. So, so on a cost analysis, uh, you can get a double frame, double frame, a double box timber hive for about $180. It comes with frames that you have to, you have to assemble and paint. Uh, you don't paint the frames, obviously. And these boxes are $180 for a double box as well. Uh, minimal assembly required, you don't have to paint them, but they, you do have to pay for frames on top of that. So it's, it's around $25 if you're gonna buy a box of frames and assemble them. So for that $25 of extra time saving, I can be doing something else. I don't have to buy paint. Hopefully they won't rot, so over the life of the of the um, actual hive itself, it'll 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 hopefully be a lot better. I've got a couple of hives out there; they're only two years old. They've got new frames, uh, new bases, and new tops. So there's another fifty dollars on top of that price that I would have initially paid. Um, and remembering that it's brand new gear, so we'll see how the bees are like them going into um, summer, um, and we'll see see what the honey production is versus the brood pattern in, in each box uh, as we go. Anyway, um, Zeke from Holistic Harvest and thanks for listening.